been playing music on Virtual DJ and the music is so loud that you can't, you want to talk, but you can't talk over it? Well, let me tell you, there's this wonderful little feature and it's called Mic Talkover. That's right, you can still keep your beats moving and with the push of a button, you guys can talk over your music. And you can also do it while you're pressing it, while while the button is pushed down, or just, just always active. Here, it's really quick, really easy, and I'm gonna show you how to do it right now and configure it to a custom button and to your keyboard. So let's begin. Uh, first and foremost, anytime you guys have any questions about what can Virtual DJ do, there's this link right here. I'm throwing it in the description. It's all of the commands. Well, there's audio input command right here, and this one is mic underscore talk over. Basically, when you push this button, you lower the volume of all decks, and then it activates the microphone. You can use mic talk over while pressed to only activate the, activate the mic while you're pressing down your button or your keyboard button or your if you're using a controller you can do it on the controller too and then you can basically tell it how low you want to make the music while you are talking and then you can even add a timer at the end of it so that way it slowly waits until it till it uh, brings the music back on up this is great if you're doing like a show on twitch or or mixcloud or a radio broadcast type thing that way you could talk over your music whenever you want and then uh, you can stop it. It's very, very easy to do. All right, let's begin. So the code is actually, it's, it's Mike underscore talkover. Very, very simple. We are going to go from the pro skin layout right here in Virtual DJ. This works for if you have a pro license or just a regular license. This is nothing really, really fancy. Just a built-in outside the box, out, out of the box feature, not outside the box feature. Very, very simple. So to configure your microphone, let's make sure your microphone is configured inside of Virtual DJ first. Hit the cogwheel, go to audio, and then click on microphone and then add your mic right here. So I am using my microphone through my USB audio interface. You can have an, a USB microphone here if you'd like. That works too. And then I'm going to send it out. I'm just sending it back to OBS with a virtual cable. You guys will have whatever different type of setup you are going to have, obviously. Ask me questions if you need to learn more about how to set up your audio and bring it into OBS because I got you. You know this. All right, once that's all set up and done, click apply, and then we're good there. Let's go to mapping. We'll do mapping first, okay? So let's pick any key, any key on the keyboard. Let's do T. T is talk over, right? We're going to talk over. So you type in the key right here, and we're going to do mic underscore talk over, okay? And then we want the audio to go to 30% of the music, and then we want a 1,000 uh, millisecond kind of release there, okay? This is, this is for T. Now I'm going to do another one, which we're going to save this first, save it, and then the next one we're going to do, copy it just to make this easier, right here, and then we're going to go P. P is the other one. Oh, we, we don't need that that code in there. And then we're, all we're going to do is add to the end of this one is while underscore press, press. Wait, Mike, yeah, while pressed. And when it turns white, it means that it recognizes this as a virtual DJ command. So when we hold the P down, it's going to activate until we let go of the P button. This is just on our keyboard, okay? We're going to click save. We're going to close. And now here we go. We're going to play the music. And then we're going to do this uh, do this little test here. Here we go. Play. So we already have talk over active. All right. So now that I've hit the T button, we're going to be talking over the music. You'll hear that the music is lower. When I press the T again, it's going to turn my microphone off and the music's going to come on up. You ready? We're going to press the T again. Now we are holding down the P button. You'll notice that the microphone actually turns off with this feature. So you don't have to worry about ever having a hot mic. So I'm not gonna talk for a little bit right now. And when I let go of the P button, it ends up reactive or it, it turns the mic off and then puts the music right back on up. Let's go and turn the microphone back on. So it's that simple to do right there. You can also configure it with your custom buttons right here. All you have to do is just right click on a custom button. I already made this one right here and it's called talk over. And we did the same exact script right there. Mic talk over 30% and then this should be 1000 milliseconds. All right. So now when we are playing our song, we're going to play our song, we turn the mic off. 
and I press the talk over button and bliggity splat, you have it. We're gonna unpress it. And you can still talk over the music if you end up pressing the on button right there. Not recommended, not recommended. All right, so it's really that simple to use the mic talk over feature. You can configure it with your um, with your keyboard, you can configure it with touch portal, you can configure it with a, a custom button, and you can also apply that script to any button on side of your DJ controller. I'm DJ LeFave. I hope this was a helpful tip for you. Nice quick hits. Like, subscribe, and follow me for more, more useful content to help you with your virtual DJ uh, journey. Out.